Hi there everybody, Thailand Phil here and today I'd like to talk about uh, how to get around Pattaya. Uh, there are three main ways to easily get around. One is your BART bus, two is your motorcycle taxi guys and ordinary normal taxis. Motorcycle taxis are certainly the quickest way to get around Patea. Being in and out of the traffic on the back of a motorcycle is certainly an experience and it's not for the faint-hearted. The only word of advice I can give to anyone experiences for the first time is keep your knees in. They have a habit of squeezing through very tight little spaces as they try to get you from uh, A to B as quickly as they can so they can go and get the next um, customer. Fares cost from about 50 baht upwards. Uh, that's per customer. Yes, you can have, as they call it, two up on the back of a bike. Yes, you can haggle, but within reason. Look out for these uh, motorcycle guys. They're usually in coloured vests. Uh, can be found on the sides of nearly all the roads around. If you're not up for uh, the motorcycle taxis, and jump on board one of the uh, blue BART buses. Well, that's what we call them over here. Travelling by BART bus is the most cheapest way to get around the tower. You'll see these blue BART buses around all the main routes. They have two rows of bench seats in the back and space for standing at the rear, if you're brave enough that is. The BART buses run around on fixed routes just like buses. They operate around downtown Pattaya, John TM and Nakua. And the cost will cost you no more than 20 bar for the whole journey on his route. Just pay the driver through the uh, passenger window and walk away. It's as simple and as easy as that. If you need change, keep your hand in the passenger side of the cab. Your hand open. Because if you don't and step away from the bar bus, they will consider it a tip and you won't get any change. BART buses can be flagged down anywhere on their route. There are no bus stops as in the UK. So stand on the side of the road when you see one coming, put your arm hand out and just wave your arm hand up and down. They quickly indicate to say they're pulling in, go round the back and jump on board. To stop a BART bus which you are on is again very easy, just above your head all the way around. Our little buttons, buzzers. Just press the buzzer and he will stop as soon as he possibly can. Again, it's as easy as that. Please don't forget when you jump off to go round to the front on the passenger side and pay him. If you find yourself going along and you realise you're going the wrong way, don't panic. Just press the buzzer, get off, pay the 20 bar because it is minimal to say the least walk across the road and wait for the next one going in the other direction Patia doesn't have many local metered taxis as they do in Bangkok and other uh, large cities but they do have 
quite a few private hire taxis. It is very rare for uh, drivers to switch on their meters if they have one. So whatever you do, agree a price, a reasonable price that you're happy to pay. May not be the first one they uh, offer you. Don't forget, this is Thailand. It's okay to barter. Long as you uh, don't get angry, speak in a normal tone voice, and you'll probably be successful. As I said, there are many private hire taxis companies, and they can be great for a day's sightseeing or uh, a transfer uh, up to one of the airports. I'm sure you probably do. I'm going to be using uh, Bangkok, but uh, there are airports and other places that you can actually uh, hire a taxi to take you there. Most hotels and guest houses can order you a taxi quite often at very short notice. Personally, when I started coming here three years ago, I used a taxi, private taxi service called NAMS Taxi. She employs all lady drivers. Yeah, surprisingly. Um, it's a really good service. You can book it online on her website. Uh, you can even ring the office, NAMS Taxi Service office, and uh, I request a taxi from uh, obviously A to B. They do airport transfers. Uh, direct from your hotel, picking you up um, and obviously taking to uh, the airport. They are very good in working out how long it will take them to get to, for example, Bangkok Airport, depending on what time of the night or day that your flight is. They also do sightseeing tours, for example, uh, as I did a few years ago, I went to uh, Tiger Park, I had photos taken with the tigers and uh, an incredible day. Um, they'll take you off to uh, golfing, onto golf courses, um, and other tourist attractions. The easiest thing to do really is to just email them off their uh, website they have good prices i put a few uh, pictures up on the screen but please be aware that these prices that i'm showing you which i took off their website today uh, can obviously be changed at any time i've also put on a note off their website to do with Songkran. Which is the water festival uh, near the beginning of April. Um, it's a very much a Thai festival. And many, many Thai people will go off and be with their relatives up country. So um, expect... Uh, difficulty in trying to travel during Sukran. I still use them for traveling from here to the UK and obviously uh, a transfer back to my condo when I return. I find them very good, very reliable. They even put in bottles of uh, cold water uh, for your journey because from uh, Hatia to Bangkok is about an hour 20 minutes hour 30 uh, while they're traveling along there are a couple of service stations along the, uh, the motorway towards Bangkok Airport and they will give you the option to stop for a toilet break or to grab some food and then carry on the fares all include all the tolls on the motorway uh, there are a couple that's all included in the price so it's it's easy and all i can do is say perhaps you'd like to give them a try i find them absolutely incredible 
Thank you ever so much for watching uh, my video vlog today. I really hope it's been of some help to you, especially if you're a newbie. Um, if you like to subscribe, perhaps you like to press a like button and say you've, uh, you've liked this uh, video vlog, it would be really appreciated. Thanks ever so much again, and uh, it's bye-bye from Thailand, Phil. Bye-bye.